Hi there, I'm Kaden. I'm Ratika. We're giving you a crash course on how to get the perfect shot using your smartphone. Today, we're making a giant movie. I don't think we have the budget for that. No, Kaden, a movie about giants. Oh, where are we gonna find a giant? I think I have an idea. Hi, Drake. For a giant movie, we need to make regular sized objects look larger than they appear. That's called force perspective. My brother Drake will show us what it will look like. So we're gonna make Drake's shoe look bigger than Vertica. To make Drake's shoe appear giant, get a piece of cardboard and cover it with the same material of the ground your actor will be standing on. So in this case, the grass. Add the shoe and place the whole platform on a table in front of the camera. Have your actor walk backwards until they look small enough to fit inside the shoe. Ta-da! Big shoe, tiny vertique. Since Drake will be our giant, we also need to use force perspective to make him, well, giant. Drake will show you a huge example. To get the shot, have your actors stand a few feet apart from each other. That's you guys. Now, as the camera person, it's up to me to make sure it looks like they're talking to each other. Kaden looks straight ahead and up. Drake looks straight ahead and down. Not so much. Perfect. So now that you learned how to get the shots, let's put them to use. And now for the world premiere of A Giant Surprise. We've been walking forever. I think we're lost. You know, they say a giant lives out here and he snacks on the trespassers that dare enter his forest. Yeah, right. There's no such thing as giants. Look. I stand corrected. Look at the size of the shoe. I mean, it could only belong to a giant. A giant with a serious case of stinky feet. Hey, you. We better get out of here before he comes looking for his shoe. Too late. <sighs> we were lost. We didn't mean to trespass. Don't eat us. Eat you? I'm not going to eat you. This is a public forest. You can go wherever you want. Then why are you so angry? I just keep losing my shoes. The truth is, I never learned how to tie them. Oh, is that all? Well, I have a tip to help teach you how. That would mean so much to me. Here, just remember this rhyme. Bunny ear one and bunny ear two. Crisscross the ears, then pull one through. I did it. Thanks for the tip. Anytime, and here's another tip. Get some shoe freshening spray. P.U. Ah! Oh no, we made him out again. Run! <laughs> Splendid work, Martika. And you as well, Kaden. We simply couldn't have done it without Drake. Sneaker. It was the sneaker that stole the show. Well, that's a wrap. See you next week.